Do you want to make bead pens? I'm going to show you how to make all of these. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright guys, these are so easy to make. Here are all the things you'll need to make these pens. These are pen blanks that were actually made for beads. They come in many colors, but I find the most popular are gold, rose gold, and silver. This bar screws off and you can screw the cap off too, but I like to keep the cap on and bead from the other side. Here are all the beads I purchased or already had. I have a variety of sizes starting from the biggest size which are bubblegum beads. I wouldn't go any bigger than this size. There are so many different textures and styles to choose from. Just make sure that the beads you choose have a bigger hole to fit the pens. I like to use either the large bubblegum beads or a combination of small and large beads. So make sure you have a few different sizes. I also purchased these silicone beads in various sizes and shapes and they are by far my favourite. You can also get different shapes like these rainbows and hot air balloons. And these acrylic discs are so beautiful. They look fantastic with the silicone beads. These are spacer beads and I purchased the ones with diamantes and some silver metallic ones for those who don't want the sparkle. These are jump rings, you need them to hold the charms. Here are some of the charms I am using and more of the diamante spaces. And lastly, I have purchased these spaces with a hanging hole, which will be perfect for the charms. So go ahead and pick out your beads and charms. This bar screws off so you can easily add the beads and the pen part is in the front of the barrel. You can also buy ink refills for this pen which is great. You can unscrew and remove the cap but I like to keep it attached when beading. Start adding all your beads in the combination you like. Big beads tend to look better if placed at the top or in the middle of the bar. Also add some spaces in between for some added interest. Once you're happy, you can screw the bar back into the pen tightly. You can also add a dob of strong glue to the end of the bar to make sure it will never unscrew. And that's it. These are definitely my current favorites. They are so trendy and I have a couple of them in my bags. Now let's do one with the charm. For the charm part, you're going to need a charm, a spacer bead that has a hanging hole and a jump ring. Using your pliers, open the jump ring, add a spacer bead and also the charm. Then close the jump ring back up. The final result should look like this and we'll make sure the charm will hang nicely on the pen. Now pick up the bar and start adding your beads. For this design, I'm going to start with a large diamante spacer followed by the charm. Then another large diamante spacer, a small bead, a small diamante spacer, the large crystal bead which is so sparkly, a small diamante spacer, another small bead, three more diamante spacers. And lastly, thank goodness, a small diamante spacer. Screw the bar back onto the barrel. I promise it will fit. Now let's do a fun time lapse of the other designs.
let me know what you guys think of these pens and which one is your favorite. They make great gifts, especially with Christmas coming up and they are pretty inexpensive. I'm going to have all the products in this video listed and linked down in the description box. I also want to show you guys this unique box template I designed for these pens. They are the perfect size and have a clear plastic holder and lid to hold the beaded pens in place. There is nothing like them in the market and make a perfect gift box for beaded pens. If you're wanting to know how I made this box, you can watch the video right here.